what? A hundred, let me say it again. $183.98 this sold for. Hey, Bolo Buddies. Thanks for watching. All right, you guys, in this video, we're going to talk about big money bolos or other unexpected bolos, items to be on the lookout for, items you can hopefully buy low and flip for a profit. I'm going to tell you where they got it, what they paid for it, and what it sold for. This is my Bolo Buddies Facebook group. There is a link down below under the link tree. You guys, if you're not in the group, come follow it. Uh, lots of great reseller information over there. But this is under the announcements, Share a Sold Best July Bolo. And I invite everybody in the Facebook group to share under this post. Make sure you shout out your YouTube channel, your whatnot, your um, social media, your selling platforms, anything that you want to see growth in, shout it out and I will mention it in the video when I do it just like this. So check out this video, learn about some bolos, see how it works. And I would love for you to come and share your best August bolo. These are posted every month under the share post at the top of the page under the featured announcements section. The first item says, I've gotten into the habit. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to read whatever you write and then we're going to look at it. All right. I've gotten into the habit of just scanning newer toys these days when I see them boxed and in good condition after my He-Man haul, which I shared in either the January or February videos where I made 50 to 100 each on almost a dozen modern, modern He-Man figurines. I found yet another good one. Modern toy at a local flea market recently. I think I paid 10 as part of a package deal for this toy and it sold for full asking price of $50 in five days. This is a Ghostbusters Plasma Series Egon Splengler <laughs> six inch action figure toy. All right, there it is. Ghostbusters, who are you going to call? I was going to, I was going to bust a tune, but decided I better not. I'll save that for whatnot. You guys, if you're not following me on whatnot, sometimes I will, um, wrap a little tune. <laughs> so come on over to whatnot. Um, whatnot is an app where I sell stuff auction style and I do a lot of jewelry and you will see this necklace in an upcoming whatnot show. So $15 to shop. If you use my referral link down below to join and I also have uh, videos that teach you how to sell on whatnot if you're looking for another platform. So you can check that video out down below as also. And if you want to sell on whatnot, I have a referral link for that too. It's a different link than the buyer's link. So use the buyers first to join, then come back and use the seller's link to request to sell. And thank you guys for sharing your bolos. And I hope to see you on whatnot. It's super fun. We drink coffee. We laugh. We have a good time. It's all live and you guys can talk in the chat. So even if you don't want to buy, just come hang out. Monster High Doll, Dracul Dracula, Dr Draculora. <laughs> that one took a minute. Dead Tired Jewelry Box Coffin Bed with Doll. Okay. She said, I bought her through Facebook Marketplace for 15 And you guys, she sold her for 170 15 into 170. Can you source on Facebook Marketplace? Yes. Can you source on whatnot? Absolutely. If you guys have bought a um, item on whatnot and flipped it for a big profit, please go over and share under the best August bolo. Even if it's not, if it's like um, from July, that's fine. Just share it. I want to see the bolos you guys are finding on whatnot. So Put them on the share post and I'll share it in a video like this. And the next item are these vintage shiny bright glow in the dark Christmas ornaments. Whoa, they glow in the dark atomic stencil. I like that stencil. She said these Christmas ornaments have been rolling around on a shelf in my garage, a.k.a. money pile for several years. I think they came from a yard sale where I got several boxes of ornaments for five dollars sold in four days for full asking price of one hundred and twenty dollars eBay store is Applebee's, Apple buys, <laughs> Apple buys, attic treasures, Christmas sells all year long. Thanks for all of the great video, Courtney. You're welcome. And thank you for sharing. Uh, you guys, Christmas ornaments, who sells them? Do you leave it up all year round? I do. How cool is it that these glow? Wow. Yep. There you go, guys. All right. You ready for the next one? 
found this Mr. Coffee scoop. Okay, so this is not big money, but this is definitely unexpected and super random and super cool. And I love it. Found these Mr. Coffee scoops in a junk kitchen box for 25 cents each at an estate sale and listed them 17 days ago. Sold one already for full asking of $19.87. Best part is I only had to list one and now just have to wait for the other to sell. Turning 50 cents purchase into nearly 40 is profit. My store is Rand Randoporium on eBay. Edit. Sold the other one for full asking today. So they both sold. How cool is that, Mr. Coffee? Nostalgic for sure, right? Okay. Um, we talked about this in another video. Now, the other video had one that had a character on the actual like pump part down inside the soap. And that one sold for crazy money. If you missed that video, you got to go find it because what? This one is new soft soap aquarium liquid hand soap, fish ocean finding Nemo pump. I don't think this one has a character in it. I think this is just soap. So yeah, you ready? Found this in my bathroom cabinet. So free to me It sold for 33 shipped on eBay. Piece of scrap on YouTube and eBay. You guys, she sold this for 30 three dollars with shipping are you kidding me 33 dollars for some soap do you think they wanted the graphic i mean i i'm so i'm confused you guys tell me what you think in the comments this one is an etsy sale i found this pair of fitz and floyd candle holders at savers for five dollars and twenty cents sold them on etsy for a hundred and twenty five my etsy shop is the perfect treasure i like that I'm also on eBay as the perfect treasure, and I run another eBay shop for a nonprofit, no kill cat shelter called Kitty Angels MA. There you go, guys. Check it out. Fitz and Floyd. Always look up Fitz and Floyd. Montana Lifestyles Out on the Range Sculpture. Found this statue at Goodwill for $8. I did a Google Lens search and could only find one that sold for $135. And the horse had a broken ear. So I started mine at 175 Buy it now since mine was mint. It was listed for almost two months and sold for asking price. Was not fun to pack, but worth it. Okay. Whoops. Here we go. Let's see. Let's look at these photos. Here it is. You'd think that'd be hard to break. wonder how the ear chipped. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. What a good flip, right? Vintage 1960s K&O Johnson number 33 toy electric onboard motor in original box. All right, you guys, if you can find these, they are definitely a boater. A boater. <laughs> I just mixed bolo and motor together. They are definitely a bolo. And new old stock, right? Or in the original box. Maybe not new old stock. Original box. Wow. Highest sale of... I'm sorry, highest sale to date. Got this miniature boat motor as part of a private pick haul. I paid $130 for everything. Checking the comps on similar items. Recent solds were around $375. Glad I checked Terapeak. Sold, or I'm sorry, found others that went for $1,200. I listed mine high and took an offer of $1,100 within hours of listing. Ooh, would this have been a good auction item? I bet having the box really helped. What a fabulous item, the dog patch picker. This one comes from Nina's Jewels on YouTube, eBay, and whatnot. She is a bolo finder, and you guys should definitely check out her YouTube channel. This is Riptide Seasons 1, 2, 3 Complete Series DVD 13 Disc Set Damage to S1 Case. Riptide. I have never seen it, know nothing about it, but this is definitely a bolo. Oh my goodness. Sold for $183.98. What? A hundred, let me say it again. $183.98 this sold for. Riptide, remember it. Look at those, look at the graphics, look at the photos. Whoa, out of print item that is hard to find was free to me. She got it free, better yet. Here we go. Cast iron vintage dressed up box candle hoarder. Doorstop rare red coat fancy. Found this gentleman fox at a thrift store I barely go to. It's way out of my way, but thank goodness I had to go somewhere out that way. They had 
they had him and a frog and I'm still kicking myself for not buying the frog. I did pay 20. That's why I didn't buy both. Took a few months and woke up to a sold of 8574. I couldn't believe it. My eBay store is Jolly's Fashion Emporium and Mercari is Jolly's Fashion Emporium. More pictures in the comments. So she just included other photos. Um, did I do this one? I think I did. Okay, that's in another video. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We're live here. We are live. Not really. I'm live. I'm live doing this video. Found this book at the Goodwill bins, weighed almost two pounds, so it cost me a dollar ten. When I checked comps there, I expected it to be worth about 30 or 40. When I got home, I realized that with the autograph, it was a hundred and eighty dollar book. Woody Hayes, OSU, you win with people. 1973 signed first printing um, dust jacket. Look at that, guys. Look at that. How cool. Great photos. Good job. Congratulations. That is fabulous. And what a nice surprise, right? Rare heart or rare find vintage Holt Howard smoking Santa ashtray and match holder. See pics. That's Santa. That doesn't look like Santa. Maybe I just can't see his hat. It's kind of cut off. I found this Holt Howard smoking Santa ashtray at my local thrift shop in a box of random items. He lost all his paint, but I recognized him immediately. Paid a dollar for him, set him at $125, took an offer of $106. I listed him as a project piece and gave a picture of what he looked like when new. Smart. Very smart. There you go, guys. Found this mother of pearl jewelry box at the Goodwill for $7.99 and sold it for $78 on Poshmark. I am Bocat77777 on Poshmark and Jackie77 on Whatnot. I enjoy visiting your Whatnot live shows when I get the chance and love to watch you on YouTube. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. It looks like she sold this for $78. And you guys, again, come over to Whatnot. I've got the referral link down below. $15 to shop. We have so much fun. Just listen to Jackie77. All right, here we go. This is an antique 1922 smile embossed soda pop bottle. Found this antique 1922 smile embossed soda pop bottle at the Goodwill for $4.99. Sold on eBay for $45. My eBay is Amethy49 underscore 4925 and my Poshmark is Mary Piot. Mercari is Angie Piot. Thank you for all you do for us. Your knowledge is so helpful. Thank you for sharing, Angie. Very interesting bolo. I don't know that I would have picked that up. So what do you guys think? Which bolo did you find the most unexpected? Which bolo are you going to be on the lookout for? I want to find one of them boat motors. $1,000. Yeah, <laughs> that's a woo wee. <laughs> All right, you guys. Um, if you want more woo wees, come over to whatnot because I'll tell you what, when I pull up something pretty, that's what I say. All right, I will see you guys soon. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching. Go share your best August bolo under my link tree is the Bolo Buddies Facebook group. You can join, it's always posted under the announcements featured section. There's also a spot for share your best plush bolo. And you guys, starting over, remember, have you watched the video yet? Type in Bolo Buddies starting over. I feel like I'm glitching. Am I glitching right now? Bolo Buddies starting over. <laughs> Type that into the YouTube search. And listing assistant Bolo Buddies. These are um, what I'm doing to kind of I guess, start over with my eBay, Poshmark, Mercari. I'm, I'm making some changes, some big changes. So if you guys haven't checked those videos out, check them out. Um, I am using List Perfectly to help me implement some of these changes. So if you want to watch and if you decide that List Perfectly, it's a cross-posting service, is something you want to try, which I've been using it since 2019, uh, check out those videos. Uh, Bolo Buddies, all one word, lowercase, 30% off your first month of List Perfectly. And there's a referral link down below for that as well. But check out those videos. Check out how I'm cross posting, how I'm using the new listing assistant to list quicker, and how I'm going to start over and refresh everything. And I am now a pro plan user. Yep. If you want to know why I switched from the business plan that I was on since 2019, it took me all this time to switch. 
I am changing it up. So check out those videos and I will see you on Whatnot live. <laughs> Thanks for watching.